हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज पार्ट थ्री ऑफ यूनिट थ्री यूजीसी नेट जीआरएफ फॉरेंसिक साइंसेस इन विच वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट डिटेक्शन ऑफ सेमिनल एंड अदर बॉडी फ्लूड्स देयर ब्लड ग्रुपिंग रेड सेल एंजाइम्स सेरम प्रोटीन्स एक्सेट्रा द वेरियस टूल्स एंड टेक्निक्स यूज फॉर द डिटेक्शन एंड कलेक्शन ऑफ बायोलॉजिकल सैम्पल्स आर ऑल्टरनेट लाइट सोर्स which is used to detect the washed stains that are not visible to the naked eye flinders technology associate card or fta card that is used uh, at room temperature for the collection shipment purification of nucleic acid uh, from uh, biological samples that is used for pcr ana- analysis another one is uh, tissue samples that are uh, present at the crime scene these tissue samples are preserved in 20% dimethyl sulfoxide or dmso saturated with sodium chloride or the tissue samples can be frozen in dry ice or co2 collection of stains is done by cutting swabbing with sterile water or saline water scraping and elution using saline or sterile water now uh, semen semen is a gelatinous mixture of cells which constitutes amino acids sugars salts iron and various other materials uh, at one ejaculation it is the volume is up to 6 ml and it contains around 100 to 150 million spermatozoa per ml <coughs> antony van leven leon hook in 1679 showed the presence of spermatozoa in semen the four glands which contributes to the secretion of seminal fluid are testis seminal vesicle prostate bulbo urethral or coppers gland the various cells that are used for uh, semen or uh, sperm production are sertoli cells which creates hematotoxic testicular barrier and nourishment of spermatozoa hematotesticular barrier is the uh, sperms are situated in outside the body the temperature of testis is slightly different from the body temperature it creates a hematotesticular barrier hemato means blood testicular testis so there is a barrier to divide them leydig cells produce testosterone in the presence of luteinizing hormones sperms are stored and matured in epididymis the various uh, conditions are oligospermia in which the males have low sperm count azoospermia in which uh, production of semen is there but the semen does not contain sperm cells aspermia complete lack of semen with ejaculation there is not uh, even semen is not present in this condition hematospermia in which there is blood in semen spermatogenesis is the life cycle of sperm the primary uh, spermatocyte is 2n or diploid then it uh, changes to secondary spermatocyte haploid cell spermatids haploid and then spermatozoa the sperm cell constitute of a head neck and a tail and it is 55 micrometer in length the head of the spermat- uh, sperm contains dna and acrosome acrosome it uh, contains digesting enzymes so that the sperm can penetrate the egg so it contains the digesting enzyme uh, hyaluronidase and acrosin and only this portion the head portion of the 
sperm would reach the egg and the dna is transferred into the egg so the digestive enzyme present here will uh, help the sperm to penetrate the egg now the various constituents present in seminal stains are the seminal plasma is rich in non enzymatic constituents and enzymatic constituents it contains high level of phosphatases alkaline m acetate nucleosidases pyrophosphatases atpases and acid phosphatases in abundance other constituents include citric acid ascorbic acid lactic acid etc choline and spermin both are present in seminal stains only so these are used for the identification of seminal stains acid phosphatase is present in abundance in seminal stains so brentamin fast blue b or acid phosphatase test is used for the identification of seminal stains the stock solution is made up of uh, the two solutions solution a and solution b solution a contains 1 g brentamin fast blue b 2 g of sodium acetate anhydrous 10 ml of glacial acetic acid and 100 ml of distilled water whereas solution b contains 0.8 g of sodium alpha naphthyl phosphate and 10 ml of distilled water the working solution is prepared by adding 10 drops of solution a 1 drop of solution b and 89 drops of distilled water so you can change it in ml also for one drop of working solution is added on the sample and there is an appearance of violet color in the presence of acid phosphatase so but this test also gives false positive with fungi bacteria many plant fecal stains vaginal secretion in vaginal secretion acid phosphatase is present but the reaction is slow and faded because it it is present in less amount but during the uh, pregnancy pregnancy time the vaginal acid phosphatase activity increases and false positive test is there tea leaves contraceptive creams resorcinol alpha naphthol 8 hydroxy quinol quinoline fluoroglucanol also give false positive test other tests for detection of uh, semen are phosphorescence test in which uh, liquid nitrogen is added on the sample and it is observed under uv so phosphorescence is observed in the seminal stain next is phosphorylcholine test in which phosphorylcholine is dephosphorylated by acid phosphatase and it converts into choline and ortho phosphate the choline the color is visible due to choline free choline violet color is there and it indicates the presence of acid phosphatase another test is leucine amino peptidase test and this test is negative for vaginal secretion vegetables blood and urine so it is the accuracy of identification of semen through this test is very high this shows positive reaction even by vesic uh, vesectomized semen samples vesectomy is the cutting of uh, vas deferens to make the male sterile now the reagent used are l lucyl uh, lucyl beta naphthyl amide plus coupling reagent which is fast garnet red one drop of each substrate and the coupling reagent is added on the stain pale orange to pink red uh, color is observed another test is sodium alpha naphthyl phosphate test in which a buffer is prepared by adding 10 g of sodium acetate 
5 ml of glacial acetic acid, 500 ml of distilled water. Solution 1 contains 250 ml of buffer and 0.63 gram of sodium alpha naphthyl phosphate. Another uh, solution that is solution 2 contains equal amount of buffer but 1.25 gram naphthalein diazo blue P. After uh, uh, after adding solution 1 we have to wait 30 seconds and then add solution 2 the color changes to purple now uh, sodium thymol phthalene uh, monophosphate test the buffer is 900 ml solution A plus solution B until pH is equal to 5.95. Solution A contains 29.5 gram trisodium citrate dihydrate in 1 liter of distilled water. Solution B contains 2.1 grams of citric acid monohydrate in 100 ml distilled water. Reagent 1 constitutes of uh, 0.185 grams sodium thymol thalin monophosphate in 100 ml buffer and reagent 2 uh, is made up of 20% sodium hydroxide that is 1 gram of sodium hydroxide in 5 ml of distilled water. So uh, 1 to 2 drops of reagent 1 is added to the sample followed by 1 to 2 drops of reagent 2. Uh, there is a gap, uh, gap between the addition of reagent 1 and reagent 2 after that, we have to wait 5 minutes and blue color is observed, which indicates the presence of seminal stain. Now, uh, as I have already, already told you that acid phosphatase is present in other body fluids also, like vaginal uh, secretion, etc. Now, prostate acid phosphatase is... Uh, 52,000 times more in semen than any other fluid. P30 is the prostate specific antigen and it is a glycoprotein produced by prostate gland and it is secreted into the seminal plasma. Its concentration is around uh, 2 to 5.5 million nanogram per milliliter. The test acid phosphatase test is uh, used for the detection of semen even in the absence of spermatozoa. P30 is used for the identification of seminal stains. It can detect uh, seminal stains from rinsed and washed clothes and also as it is a product of protein degradation, it can also be used on uh, for the detection of very old stains and in vasectomized and ergiospermic individuals. Apart from human beings, P30 can also be found in cat. Uh, Octolone double diffusion or cross, crossover electrophoresis can also be done for the detection of P30. So NTP30 octolone double diffusion or is used. Extract of the spectrum a suspected stain is placed in the cathodic well of the gel and the antiserum is placed in the anodic well. Now, electrophoresis is uh, initiated at 120 volt for 30 minutes. The white line of precipitin indicates the presence of seminal stain and after staining this white line with amido black, Deep blue black staining is observed. Another technique is counter immunoelectrophoresis, and it is done for the detection of P30 based on antigen antibody interaction for circulating antibodies. So, th uh, the various methods for the identification of prostate specific antigen that is P30 are uh, these. Another uh, characteristic feature of seminal stain is the presence of 
lactate dehydrogenase activity ldh x so it is located in primary spermatocytes of male reproductive system and it is absent in vasectomized or aspermic males ldh is a uh, uh, constitute of various bands ldh 1 2 3 4 5 and all these bands are observed in venous and menstrual blood also but ldh x is specific only for seminal stains or semen now uh, some facts regarding seminal stains or semen the maximum duration till intact spermatozoa can be present in vagina is 24 hours whereas disintegrated spermatozoa can stay in cervix uh, till 7 to 10 days and in cervix and uterus till 7 to 10 days the liquefaction of the seminal secretion occurs within a very short duration due to prostatic fibrinolysis also there is an organism which looks exactly uh, which looks like spermatozoa which is tinea solium this picture on the left side is of tinea solium and on the right side here it is spermatozoa here you can see it also constitutes of a head neck and tail it also constitutes of a head neck and tail confirmatory tests for semen now a uh, soaking method for collection in which seminal stain is cut and soaked in acidulated water mostly picric acid is used now christmas tree stain it is developed by upids and it contains picro indigo carmine and nuclear fast red dyes uh, which turns the tip of sperm head into pink the bottom of the head dark red and middle portion into blue whereas the tail is visible in yellowish green color nuclear fast red is an anthroquinone dye or calcium red that stains the sperm another technique is phase contrast microscopy ELISA is also used for the detection of P30 or prostate specific antigen. Alternative light source detects semen uh, stains uh, and shows blue white fluorescence. Now, uh, monoclonal antibodies MAP4E6 and seminal vesicle specific antigen, which is SBSA is used to detect human seminal plasma antigen 4e6 this is uh, mab is monoclonal antibody the antigen is 4e6 and it is secreted by epithelial cells of the ejaculatory duct and it is not found in animals and present in a zoospermic persons as well so these are used for the confirmatory test uh, these are used as the confirmatory test for semen now uh, the crystal tests for semen are choline or florence crystals test uh, i have already told you that choline and spermin are present in abundance in seminal stains so the reagent for the identification of choline are iodine 2.54 grams, 1.65 gram potassium iodide and distilled water 30 ml. The sample containing uh, semen reacts with iodine to form choline periodide. The brown uh, needle shaped crystals are observed under the microscope. Choline is uh, uh, originates from the seminal vesicle. The richest concentration of choline in the spermatic fluid was determined by Fletcher et al. in 1935. Now, another crystal test is for spermin, that is Barbarios or spermin test. The reagent is picric acid 1 gram in 30 ml distilled water. Sample containing uh, semen reacts with <coughs> picric acid to form needle shaped crystal of spermin picrate. Another test is Puranan's test. 
the reagent used is dinitro naphthol sulfonic acid or naphthol yellow s it reacts with spermin to form orange crystals now uh, vomit examination the main uh, uh, constituents of vomit are mucus hydrochloric acid endothelial cells and undigested or semi digested food material for the test of mucus uh, 33% acetic acid is added drop by drop and uh, opalescence appears it can be due to mucus or lipid substance so in order to differentiate the mucus from lipid substance more amount of acetic acid is added if the opalescence does not disappear the mu uh, presence of mucus is com confirmed as lipid globulins are uh, dissolved by the excess acetic acid but mucus remains constant so another te uh, the test for hcl is ginsberg test in which uh, 10% vanillin in an alcohol is added in a porcelain evaporating dish and uh, the contents are allowed to dry brilliant red color indicates the presence of presence of free hcl endothelial cells are identified uh, after centrifugation the extract uh, centrifugation of the extract was done for 10 minutes and a thin film of the extract is made on a slide and observed under the microscope undigested and semi digested food materials are also observed in the microscope now uh, fecal stains fecal stains contains undigested food uh, intestinal uh, epithelial cells intestinal bacteria bile pigments electrolytes and water color of feces <coughs> is due to various reasons uh the brown color of the fecal stain of the feces is due to the combination of bile and bilirubin uh, that is uh, from dead rbcs so this is the normal color yellow color is due to undigested fat in the stool or it can be uh, the undigestion of the fat can be because of parasitic infection pale or gray color is due to insufficient bile output conditions due to uh, diseases such as gall stones liver problems etc black or red color is uh, due to the presence of, uh, due to iron pills or bismuth containing medications or bleeding in the upper part of digestive tract if the bleeding is in the upper part of the digestive tract the feces is black if the bleeding is in the lower part of the digestive tract the bleeding is red blue color is due to prussian blue or blue uh, coloring used in the treatment of radiation cesium and thallium poisoning violet or purple color is uh, a symptom of porphyria green color of feces is due to large amount of unprocessed bile in the digestive tract and strong spelling diarrhea silver color is uh, due to biliary obstruction of uh, any type which combines with gastrointestinal bleeding that is biliary obstructions create white color of feces and the gastrointestinal blood creates black stool and these combine to form silver now uh, the various components which constitutes for the order of human feces are benzopyrrol vol uh, volatiles which are indole or scatol uh, methyl sulfides methyl mercaptan dimethyl sulfide dimethyl trisulfide dimethyl disulfide and hydrogen sulfide edelman's test for fecal stains so it constitutes of two solutions solution 1 is 40% alcoholic mercury chloride 
and solution 2 is 40% alcoholic zinc chloride solution solution 3 is of a mild alcohol so so three solutions are used uh, in this test zinc urobilin stable complex is observed as green fluorescence which indicates the presence of fecal stain uh, DNA analysis is also possible for, from fecal matter because of the presence of intestinal epithelial cells. Now, uh, the color of feces. Heme, that is the iron part of the hemoglobin, it undergoes catabolism and forms bilirubin. Bilirubin is then converted into urobilinogen in the intestine and a portion of urobilinogen gets reduced to stercobilinogen and spontaneous oxidation of urobilinogen and stercobilinogen forms urobilin and stercobilin. These urobilin and stercobilin produces characteristic color of the feces. Now uh, about urine. Urine contains uh, various inorganic ions such as sulfate, phosphate, chloride and also contains amines uh, such as urobilinogen, urea and creatinine. Color of urine is due to uh, the urinary pigment uroprone. Urine gives white fluorescence under UV light. Because of the breakdown of phosphocreatinine uh, into phosphorus. Test for urea. Uh, <coughs> enzyme urease catalyze the breakdown of urea into ammonia and carbon dioxide. Xenthydrol uh, test. Xenthyd in which the reagent is made up of 3 mg of xenthydriol and glacial acetic acid and distilled water in the ratio 2 is to 1 and the final volume will be 10 ml uh, on the sample a drop of acetic acid solution was placed and then xanthidriol crystals are uh, added and a slide is observed under the microscope Feathery needle shaped crystals of dizenthyl urea are observed. Another test is urea nitrate test in which there is a reaction between urea and uh, P dimethyl aminosinamaldehyde, PDMAC, the red pigment, and hexagonal crystals are produced. Other tests for urine identification are creatinine test or Jaffe reaction. So in the presence of saturated aqueous solution of picric acid and a weak base that is sodium hydroxide, urine gives a bright red coloration uh, due to the formation of creatinine picrate. Another test is creatinine crystal test or Gies method in which sample is placed in a china dish. Few drops of acetone are added and it is heated till brownish powder is formed. This brownish powder is placed on a slide and one drop of nitric acid is added. The resultant, uh, the slide is observed under the microscope in which rhomboidal transparent crystals are observed. Test for amines or Schiff's base formation. Uh, so on addition of PDMs, uh, PDMAC, to the sample dark pink or red coloration will be observed i have already discussed about this test earlier so a urease bromothymol blue paper test in which bromothymol blue that is an acidic uh, acid base indicator is used to convert urea into ammonia by the application of lip litmus paper and the positive identification is done by uh, the turning of paper into blue color. So as ammonia is basic, 
so it will convert the paper into blue now urostra urastrat is used to detect urea in blood sample by the conversion of urease to ammonia it is used for the blood samples okay radio immuno acid detection uh, as urine contains high molecular weight glycoprotein that is thp tam horse whole protein uh, the, the radio immuno acid detection of urine is possible it is based on the interaction of unlabeled antigen with a fixed amount of, uh, of corresponding label antigen or uh, an antibody so a radio immuno acid detection of uh, urine is done by thp protein now uh, saliva saliva contains large amount of epithelial cells because of inner cheek wall cells uh, these are uh, the inner cheek wall cells and it is used for dna analysis saliva contains enzyme amylase or talin uh, it is produced by parotid and submandibular gland that are used in the, uh, this enzyme is used in the digestion of carbohydrate the ph of saliva is 7.4 radial diffusion is done uh, for the identification of saliva stains the stain is extract is placed into the well and <clears throat> starch is already incorporated in the gel it is allowed to diffuse the alpha amylase present in the stain will hydrolyze the starch and the color change is observed lugol's uh, iodine solution it constitutes of iodine 1 g potassium iodide 2 g and distilled water 200 ml solution 2 contains 0.5% of starch solution so three drops of starch solution were added in uh, sample and it is mixed and incubated for 1 hour at 37 degrees celsius then two drops of lugol's iodine solution are added the absence of dark blue starch iodine complex indicates the amylase activity amylase uh, activity by um, no, no, amylase hydrolyze the starch and the blue the dark blue starch iodine complex is not formed another one is thiocyanate or rodan uh, rodanite test on a uh, few drops of hcl and ferric chloride solution were added on the sample and it results in the formation of yellowish green color fardebas test is also based on amylase activity so uh, in the fardebas reagent it consists of a dye cross linked with starch so when the amylase present in the saliva digested uh, digest the starch component the dye gets freed and the solution becomes blue quantitation of this dye can be done at 620 nanometer wavelength using uv visible spectroscopy the intensity of color is directly proportional to the concentration of amylase saliva contains amylase 1 and amylase 2 uh, uh amylase 2 is present in human blood pancreas and vaginal secretion so saliva contains amylase 1 human blood pancreas and vaginal secretions contains amylase 2 jusola and belentil uh, belentin in 2003 isolated mitochondrial rna from blood semen and saliva stains and used them for rt pcr analysis the saliva specific genes used by them are stethrin histidine 3 PRB one, two, and three. Few things about vaginal secretions. So, Dordelin bacillus is a gram-positive bacteria found in vaginal secretion. Lochia is the vaginal discharge after giving birth. 
so vaginal uh, secretion consists of uh, i have already told you about this bacteria it is a lactobacilli its presence is a sign of healthy vaginal milieu vaginal secretion can be characterized on the basis of glycogenated epithelial cells periodic acid shift reagent is used to identify vagina, vaginal secretion on the basis of detection of these glycogenated epithelial cells now some other fluids secreted by the body are lactam it is uh, uh, sorry lactam is mm, scientifically formulated milk the the first milk uh, given to the, the powdered milk given to the baby which uh, which is designed to provide 100% of daily nutrients <coughs> now uh, lysine lysine is an essential amino acid but the it is not made inside the body so lysine should be taken from uh, food or other supplements uh, another one is matrix metalloproteinase or mpp14 estrogen receptor alpha and fibrinogen that are used for the detection of menstrual blood colostrum is a clear transparent secretion uh, see, uh, this is squeezed out of the nipples of the pregnant women so these are some uh, important terms now uh, polymorphic enzymes enzymes are located in red blood cells which are responsible are uh, to catalyze biochemical reactions of the body pgm phosphoglucomatase peroxidase and haptoglobin are red cell enzymes isoenzymes are uh, the enzymes that have same function but different physical chemical properties the isoenzymes present in dried blood stains are pgm adenylate uh, kinase erythrocyte acid phosphatase and esterase d red cell and uh, isoenzymes uh, are also adenosine deaminase glutamate pyruvate transaminase phosphoglucomatase so now again erythrocyte or red cell isoenzyme carbonic anhydrase it catalyzes the reversible hydration and dehydration of Uh, carbon dioxide and carbonic acid so carbonic anhydrase is the rbc enzyme which uh, converts co2 into car carbonic acid and carbonic acid into co2 so john edsel discovered uh, the first competitive inhibitor of enzyme carbonic anhydrase that is imidazole pgm and estrate d r semen proteins visualization of estrase d can be done using 4 methyl umbilifrel uh, acetate fluorogenic substrate is used for the detection of estrase d isoenzyme pattern transferrin and sperm diaphorase are the protein markers present in human semen pgm polymorphism uh, are where the polymorphism takes place so the locus is 1 on chromosome 1 2 on chromosome 4 and 3 on chromosome 6 now uh, serum proteins haptoglobin is a protein present in rbc blood serum and wbc it is produced by liver and uh, its main function is to clear free hemoglobin from circulation haptoglobin is a uh, hemoglobin binding protein and is found in alpha globulin fraction of the serum the two alleles hp1 and hp2 can be separated using electrophoresis it is mostly used for the polymorphic uh, uh, it is mostly used for the identification before dna profiling 
Serum proteins HP and GC group specific component are major vitamin D binding protein. Examination of albumins and globulins is done in serum protein analysis. Thank you for watching. For more such videos, uh, share and subscribe my YouTube channel Vidhi Vigyan.